I just wanted to cover the basics of the difference between the two types of skincare. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. So I just have a quick video for you guys today. It is all about medical grade skincare versus over-the-counter skincare. So as many of you guys know, I work with a cosmetic surgeon and I have been in the skincare business, the medical grade skincare business, for a long time. And one of the main questions and the, one of the most questions I should say that we get is what's the difference between medical grade skincare versus over the counter skincare? And a lot of people really don't know the difference. So that's, I'm just going to break it down so simple for you guys um, because again, I get that question still a lot. And because a lot of people really don't know, I mean, I, there's not a lot of people that talk about medical grade skincare. It's not widely known because it's not. Um, available in stores, it's not seen on commercials. So a lot of people really don't know what the difference is between the two types of skincare. And I don't hear many people on YouTube talking about medical grade skincare. So I'm gonna tell you guys today really easy what the difference is between the medical versus any over-the-counter skincare, be it drugstore skincare, skincare that you can get at Sephora, skincare that you get at um, a department store, all of that is over-the-counter skincare. So let me tell you what the difference is. So a lot of people are kind of lured into over-the-counter skincare because like I was saying, they're more widely available. You can go into Nordstrom, you can go into Sephora, any of those stores and pick up some expensive skincare. And they all have claims of, you know, this benefit and that benefit. And, um, you know, you see advertisements on TV for them. So you kind of get, you know, lured into thinking that these are the really good types of skincare. But all those over the counter skincare products, while they can have some benefits for your skin, they absolutely cannot fix actual skin problems. They cannot get deep enough into the skin to actually um, change your skin. So there's pretty much three main reasons why medical grade skincare is going to be way more beneficial than over-the-counter skincare. So number one, medical grade skincare has a much higher concentration of active ingredients than any over-the-counter skincare will have. The reason that they have higher concentrations is because these products are dispensed and sold by doctors and not over-the-counter by a saleswoman. So products from a department store, Sephora, drugstore, all those over-the-counter products are formulated for everyone. They don't meet specific needs of anybody. They're formulated for anyone to use and that's because they're not um, being sold again by a doctor. They don't have those high enough ingredients to really um, do anything to your skin. Anyone can use them because the active ingredients are in such small amounts. Okay, number two, in order to get real results from your skincare, the skincare has to be directed towards the deep layers of your skin. Over-the-counter skincare products are only geared towards the outermost layer of your skin, the skin that's really actually just shedding off. That is as deep as any over-the-counter, no matter what they claim, that is as deep as that product is going to get. Medical grade skincare products will get down into the dermis of your skin, which is more of the middle layer of your skin. They get way, way deeper into the actual layers of the skin. And this is where the elastin, the collagen, all of that is in those middle layers, as well as they will get into the deep layers where actually it can actually change your skin cells. So that is a huge difference between the medical grade and the over-the-counter skincare is just the way the over-the-counter is not going to break the surface of your skin, whereas the medical grade is going to get into all the dermis, the deep layers of your skin, and actually will change your skin cells, make your skin cells younger. Anything that you're trying to change with your skin, it will get deep enough to actually change and make your skin better. And number three, medical grade skincare will actually give you real results, whereas all the over-the-counter skincare, they can claim this and they can claim that and the pretty packaging. It is not going to change your skin like medical grade skincare. If you are serious about anti-aging and serious about changing your skin, for the better, then you have to have to invest in medical grade skincare. It just really does make a world of difference. And if you wanna treat fine lines and wrinkles and get into the deeper layers of your skin to really do so, medical grade skincare is the only skincare that will really treat those lines and wrinkles and give you the results that you are looking for in a skincare. So again, medical grade skincare has been scientifically proven to give you actual skin changing results. They are published in medical journals all over because they can effectively get into those layers of skin and effectively change your skin. Medical products actually transform the skin because they get into the deep layers of the skin where any problems arise and that's also where the collagen and elastin are there and that's where the skin cells are produced. So 
to wrap it all up, that is pretty much the three main reasons why medical grade skincare is going to be way more effective than any over the counter products claim to be. And that is just, that's not just my opinion because I work with medical grade skincare, it's an actual fact. So I hope this kind of clears up just that kind of basic question of what's the difference between medical grade versus over the counter skincare. Leave any questions down below. And for all you guys that have been with me for a while, you probably know some of these things already, but there, you know, I do still get this question a lot. So I just wanted to cover the basics of the difference between the two types of skincare. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.